Hello guys and welcome to CE Box Tutorial Channel. So marami talaga nagre-request sa uh, amin channel na gumawa raw kami ng mga video tutorials tungkol sa mga past board exam problems. Pero way back 2019 kasi ang focus talaga namin is mag-create ng mga playlist na maaaring gamitin ng mga undergrad students. Okay, pero ngayon, since marami naman na kaming nagawang mga playlists and video tutorials sa mga subjects na maaaring gamitin ng mga estudyante during their undergrad uh, study, so ngayon, nakapag-design na kami na gumawa ng mga set of problems na lumabas noong mga nakaraang CE board exam. Okay, so our first problem is noong May 2015. So, this is our situation number 1. The portable camping table shown in the figure is to support a load 1,500 newton at a variable distance x from D. Yan, yung distance x. So, if x is equivalent to 0.60 meters, determine the following. Letter A. Uh, number 1, the reaction at A. Na kung saan ang magiging sagot natin dapat is 900 newton. Number 2, the reaction at B is 600, at B, okay, which is 600 Newton. And let, uh, number 3, the reaction at D, kung saan ang sagot ay 900 Newton. So, lagyan natin ang distance to, yung ating X. So, this is 0.60 meters. So, kung 0.60 to, and this is 1,500 millimeters, so this is equivalent to 1.5. Therefore, this is equivalent to 0.90 meters okay and this is um 400 millimeters so this is 0.4 meters and this is 200 200 millimeters so this is 0.20 meters and since ang pinapasolve sa ating problem is mga reaction ipig sabihin dapat aware na kayo and master na ninyo yung different resistance or reaction ng different supports and connection. So, kung hindi pa kayo or hindi nyo pa masyadong kabisado yung concept na yun, pwede ninyong panoorin yung nasa aming YouTube channel under sa Status of Rigid Bodies, Chapter 3, Equilibrium of Parallel Forces. So, meron kami discussion dito, pinakaunang video namin. Dito namin pinag-usapan o dito namin diniscuss. Ayan. So, diniscuss namin lahat ng different supports and connections dyan. So, dito yung pin, hinge, and roller. Okay? So, dapat sa drawing pa lang, alam na ninyo kagad kung ano yung hinge dito or roller or um, in, uh, smooth surface. Okay, so dito, yung ating point A and B is smooth surface. So, ang reaction niyan is perpendicular to the surface. Since ang ating surface dito is horizontal, therefore, ang reaction natin sa A is vertical. Okay, so this is RA. Vertical, of course, kasi yun ay perpendicular to the horizontal surface. And of course, yung ating B rin is smooth surface. So, this is vertical then na RB. Okay, so, ang ating P is equivalent daw sa 1,500 Newton. So, based on our FBD at the full structure, we can use summation of moment to solve RA or RB. So, ang gawin natin, mag-moment muna tayo sa P. Summation of moment at P is equivalent to 0. Ang assumption natin is clockwise positive. So, RA iikot ng clockwise. So, that is positive RA multiplied by moment arm na 1.5 meters. Then, yung ating P is iikot ng counterclockwise sa B. Okay. Pakita natin yung ikot niyan. And, so, iikot siya ng counterclockwise. So, that is negative P which is equivalent to 1,500 Newton multiplied by moment arm na 0.90. It's equivalent to 0. Okay? So, therefore, ang ating RA is equivalent to, transpose natin to, so magiging 1,500 Newton multiplied by 0.90 over 1.5. Bumit natin ang calculator natin. 1,500 multiplied by 0.90 over 1.5. At ang sagot natin ay 900 Newton. 
So, pwede rin naman kayo gumamit ng ship salt. So, pinaita lang namin to para sa mga hindi sanay na mag ship salt or yung calculator na walang ship salt. Okay, so kung ship salt ang ating RA, gawin natin X. Then, multiplied by 1.5. Then, minus 1,500 multiplied by 0.90 is equivalent to 0. So, ang lalabas dito is 900. Okay. So, ngayon, yung RB, pwede na nating masolve by using summation of forces vertical. Hindi na natin kailangan pa mag-moment sa A. Kasi ang unknown na lang naman na force na vertical sa whole structure is RB. So, we can use summation of forces vertical. Summation of forces vertical is equivalent to 0. Assumption natin, lahat ng upward forces is positive. Ang RA upward, therefore it is positive 900 Newton minus P which is equivalent to 1,500 then plus RB is equivalent to 0. Therefore, transpose natin ng 1,500 magiging positive 1,5 then transpose natin ng 900 magiging negative 900. Kaya ang sagot sa RB is 600 Newton. Okay. Next, yung reaction naman daw sa D. Ano ba makikita ninyo sa D? Kung isusum, isusum in natin yan, ang D natin is a pin connection. Yan. So, kung pin connection yan, ibig sabihin, we have two reaction or connection reaction. That is vertical and horizontal reaction. So, ang gawin natin, kunin natin yung free value diagram at member DE. So, dito na lang natin lagay. Ayan. So, this is point E. And this is point D. And this is P which is equivalent to 1,500 Newton. This is point 6 na. So, point 6 meters and point 90 meters. So, ang reaction natin sa D is dalawa. Isang vertical and isang horizontal and then sa E naman since ito ay ano nakapatong lang so ibig sabihin this is a roller support kung roller support dyan that is perpendicular to its surface ang surface niya is horizontal kaya naka vertical tayo ngayon since ang ating uh, force is vertical lang therefore walang sasaluhin ang ating DH kaya ang ating DH is magiging equivalent to 0 so, ngayon, matusog na natin kagad yung DB by summation of moment at E. Summation of moment at E is equivalent to 0. Clockwise is positive. Actually, pares na pares lang din yan sa ating summation of moment at D para masolve yung RA na 900 Newton. Therefore, ang ating DB dito is equivalent to 900 Newton. O pwede rin naman, isa-isahin ninyo ulit, mag-moment ulit kayo sa E, para saan din naman ang lalabas. Ngayon, um, ugali ko kasi as instructor sa mga students ko, nilalagyan ko siya ng final answer dito ng reaction. So, since nag-positive yung ating 900 Newton dito, ibig sabihin, tama yung ating assumption sa direction ng RA. Kaya, yung direction ng RA dito is upward. Ang direction ng RB, tama rin kasi nag-positive ang ating magnitude. Therefore, it is uh, upward. And yung ating 900 Newton, hindi nyo na kailangan pang ilagay yung kanyang direction. Bakit? Kasi, actually yes, pwede rin naman. Pero kasi yung, mag kung lalagyan nyo siya ng direction, itong direction na to is applicable lamang sa uh, member DE. Kasi pag pumunta tayo sa member DCE, yung ating 900 Newton is magiging downward na. And under yun sa uh, law of motion, okay, na action and reaction. Okay, so this is our situation number one from CE Board Exam, May 2015. Okay, so kung first time nyo itong makapanood ng aming tutorial, so don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the notification on our YouTube channel. So thank you for watching. Bye!